learn for you, Dogen. But Noah can't know. You owe me a lot of script, Faith. I expect you to deliver on your promise. Do you ever have dreams? Something that you hope to fight so hard to gain in your life? A goal that you wish to reach? We all have dreams. For the ones who claim that they don't, they are the ones who have lost them. For people like Destiny Williams, she is one of those people. She lost her dreams a long time ago, and now she wishes to crush the dreams of those that dare to dream. In my life, I've always dared to do what others only dream of. I've fought against oppression, tyranny, and contempt, all in the name of what I believe in. I've lost family and friends too many times to count, all in this pursuit. And for anyone else, it would have been enough to break them. Enough to convince them that their fighting meant nothing in the end. That if we don't stop them now, now, the corporations will rule our lives. I said step back! Not now, honey. I have to finish this. Girl, over here. You'll be safe in here. Just stay put. Faith, I'm scared. Let us go, Kruger. You should have cooperated, Dr. Connors. I didn't want this. Mommy, what is that? That, my little squirrel, is your future. Martin and Erica Connors, two of the bravest people I've ever known. Because they were my parents. They always did their best to stand up and fight for their own individual beliefs. Their dreams. Until the riots took place. My life changed forever that day. My outlook on the world was skewed and turned upside down. Now I look at things a lot differently. I see how dark this world can truly be if you let your dreams turn into nightmares. When you let the conglomerate control your very existence. I've never allowed that to happen. I knew that I could handle myself against whoever stood against change. Did that make me a rebel to some? Yes. An agent of change? Perhaps, a threat to society, to some. But I continued to run. I continued to fight. And now, as fate would have it, destiny stands in the way of the change that this company needs. Not now. I need to finish this. You have no right. Don't touch him. Erica. Shoot him. Who's that in the window? The damn kid. Get her. It's a cat. It's me. Where's mommy? I want mommy.
It's been in the dark for too long. The inmates have been allowed to run free without the fear of the consequences that come because of it. But that is why I have to keep fighting. I will fight. And I will be the one to start bringing the change that this company has been desperately needing for so many years. I'm sad to see I was wrong about you. You can see yourself out. Wait, what? That's it? What else is there? I once knew a young woman who would defy anyone and anything, even me, in order to do what she felt was right. But you're clearly not her. You're broken. Take the drawing and go. And don't show your sulking face here again. Since when do you care for what's right? When it coincides with my interests, why are you still here? Because you're wrong. I'm not broken. Prove it. I will. Destiny Williams, Ivana. I know you may have dreams of your own, but I do too. My dream is to be the inspiration that others wish to follow. My dream is to change the perception of this company. My dream is to win the DCA Wildcats Championship. My name is Faith Connors, and I will be the catalyst that changes the Destiny Championship Alliance. Mommy, what is that? That, my little squirrel, is your future.